I'm gonna finish my father's mission and kill the Emperor. Don't make me kill you too. Are you forgetting that the Emperor and your father were traveling companions? Yeah, the Emperor and my dad went to the future. But then the Emperor came back here, ironically, just to be killed by me. The Emperor never came back. What? I've seen him. You were with me when we saw Emperor Diviculus, remember? What? <laughs> you, you think Diviculus... You think he was the Emperor back then? <laughs> oh, poor boy. <laughs> Lita? I want to go up there and end this myself. But I just feel like I don't have the stomach for it anymore. Some people can run on vengeance forever, but not you. You're a leader. A hero. Just like Lars. And you? I'm not going up there for vengeance. What are you going up there for? I'm just cleaning up a mess. Yep. That's my job. Bye, Eddie. How do we stop this, Ophelia? One of us has to die. Okay. I nominate the person who sold us out to the demons. You're right. Better you than me. Please, do not stop. You two have been having such an entertaining war. I see you called in your boyfriend for help. A eh, Sicoria? No, uh, Wait. Sicoria? Sicoria? This girl? This sad human girl? Ha 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 ha! Oh, you think she is the Grand Demon Witch? The White-Winged Death? Ha 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 ha! <laughs> this soggy puppet couldn't hold a candle to Emperor Sakoria. The Emperor was our most fierce, our most bloodthirsty warrior. Oh, I'll admit I was pleased when she left our time, her throne unattended. But when she did not return, I mourned for her. I thought she had failed. What are you talking about? She did fail. My father killed her, right? She's never coming back. <laughs> That's not um, exactly what your father did to her. The road can be a lonely place, don't you think? No, she succeeded in sending us a great wealth of secrets. Not from the future, but from our past. Through the vessel of her own child. Thank you, son of Sakoria, for completing your mother's mission, for teaching us the secrets of the Titans, and ensuring our rule over this land forever. But you said... That I smelled her blood in the temple. I did, just as I can smell it now. <laughs> Coursing through your veins. No way. Imagine my relief when I found out it was just you, and not Sakoria, back to fight me for the throne. Why are you acting so surprised? You're wearing her shirt. You're wielding her axe. Now, we may finally crush this Black Tear rebellion forever. Starting like we did the last time. It's hard. Oh. Ophelia! Oh, please. That was nothing compared to what you did to her. made her 
turn into a little monster. Now let me show you how to make a big one. <laughs> Let it go. Mangus, get back on the board. Sometimes it hurts. Oh, 
much better. Everything in that general direction must die! Leave me! Honor! Because at least I know 
You're not my son. There aren't many who can say that. Whatever victories your demon blood grants you will soon be unraveled by your human weakness. Come and see me when you grow a pair as big as your mother's. Hope he's talking about horns. Son of Sakoria, suckled by the dry teat of man. You are half so many things, I doubt any part of you is whole. Is there even a word for a creature such as you? Yeah, I'm a roadie. I keep the trash off the stage. Pitiful being. What? Is that my blood? Why are you screaming? When did I get so I've had more limbs removed than that. <laughs> Please gather that one up for Christ. You only make me sick. You know how long it took to create that creature. Good. 
Uh, I'll be back. Silence! Die with dignity! You think you can hurt and temper? Tonight, we are here to celebrate a great man, a true hero, who fought by our side, who led us to freedom, who believed in us when no one else did. A man who should never be, who will never be, forgotten. When Lars Halford fell, the cause seemed lost. But it survived, because there was another great warrior in our midst. Let us not forget the sacrifice and bravery of Lita Halford, everybody! Um... <clears throat> My brother saw goodness in people. Even in people for whom I had nothing but suspicion. Now I hope that we can stand together. I hope we can all stand together. For the honor of Bladehenge, for the freedom of its people, and for the glory 
of its metal! Hey, man. You're missing the party. Oh, uh, yeah. You know, I'm more comfortable back here. Yeah. Oh, here. I got something for you. Aw, oh, Mangus, you didn't have to get me. Hey, wait. This is my tour book. <laughs> yeah, I swiped it. And it seems you wrote on it. Well, I wanted to leave you a little note, and then some of the other guys wanted to sign it for you. Don't forget about us, man. Dudes, I'm not going away. I just got a couple errands to run. I'll be right back. You better. I'm not doing the loadout by myself. You don't have to do the loadout at all. We're staying here for good. The tour is over? Yeah, man. The tour is over. We're home now. Good roadie knows his whole job is to make someone else look good. Keep someone else safe. Help someone else do what they were put here to do. A good roadie stays out of the spotlight. If he's doing his job right, you don't even know he's there. Once in a while he might step on stage just to fix a problem, to set something right. But then before you even realize he was there, or what he did, he's gone. <laughs> 